What's happening, Chunky? Oh, I'm I'm crocked. <laughs> I've popped a calf muscle. I'm hobbling around. I'm like my foot. I'm like ballet dancer. One foot ballet dancer. I'm on my tippy toes, hobbling around. Wednesday night, cage football, Beckenham goals. And I just scored the most incredible screamer into the top corner. Run down the right, cut in on the left. Like an arrow, straight in the water goal. There was two minutes left, so it's an hour football. No subs, ball never goes out. I hadn't, I, had a little, I forgot my water bowl. Could have been that. Anyway, I'm running through again and I'm just about, and I unleash a shot. And as I shot, I thought, who threw that stone at me? And I looked around, there was no one there. It felt like someone had thrown like a, a rock about the a size of like somewhere between a golf ball and a tennis ball, like about that big, at the back of my calf. I looked on the floor. I said, who threw that? Everyone went, what? Because it felt like something... Had... And then I tried to put my foot down. Oh, my God. The pain. The absolute pain. It, it, the muscle had popped out. So I said, it's all right, I'll go in goal. <laughs> go in fucking goal? Are you mad? So I hobble over to the goal because I know there's only two minutes. They have a big clock up there. It says 8.58. And I thought, we're winning by two goals here. Do you know what I mean? Don't let the team down. Carry on. Come on, you soldier. You warrior. I was, I was absolutely... Anyway, I managed to, to get home, wake up yesterday morning. Now I'm out. Oh, I was out all day yesterday. Fucking hell, hobbling around. It's serious. It brings into perspective your whole life. Like your mobility. If you lose mobility, if you if you're suffering, if you're in pain, your height everything's hyper, but also you're sensitive to, to your body, like who you are, and and what's your capabilities. And suddenly you realize that you can't do things. There's things you can't do because you're because you're injured. You're, you know, all those things that you just take for granted, like walking. Isn't that mad? Yeah, they say it's four to eight weeks. I watched a physio on the YouTube, like football physio. They say, I don't even want to see a player for the first eight to ten days. Just rest, just walk, just do whatever you have to do. Like, you know, I I don't think I, I can, like, take off four to eight weeks from football. What will I do? I, I've, I've pulled out of tonight's match, Mondays, next Wednesday, next Friday. I play three days every other day. What am I going to do with my life? What am I going to do? It means everything to me, football. You're fucking 60, mate. <laughs> You're not a kid. You're not a little kid. I can, you can do what you want. Age doesn't matter. Age is just a concept of time. That's not real. You are who you are, what you think and what you feel. Everyone gets injured. Like you've been playing like what, like well over a year now. You've not been injured once. I did pull that, my muscle there once, but it wasn't that bad. Again, what's going on, Chunky? What about the news? Oh, wonderful. You might want to hear about me. And how I'm feeling. You know, I'm not great. Does no one care? <laughs> he shoots. He scores. He scores another goal. See, this week I got two goals on Monday night. It was such a good game. And it's nice to have that feeling and we won 4-3. And then I scored two goals on Wednesday night and one of them was like absolute screamer. So I'll just carry those moments in my heart where I saw the ball. It's the most amazing feeling ever hit the net.